I'm decreasing the stitches for the crown of my hat and the circumference of my knitting is becoming a little bit too tight on the circular needle. So I have to switch over to double points. I'm going to use a set of four, three of which will go onto the stitches on the work. So I'm going to put one third of my stitches onto each needle here. And as I continue decreasing, those needles will move closer and closer together, maintaining that small circumference without stretching out my stitches. So the needles move together in a little triangle to keep my stitches the right size. My first step is take off my stitch marker and I'm putting it in the fabric right where my first needle is going to start knitting. So I've grabbed my first empty double pointed needle in my right hand and I'm going to begin working my row onto that needle. And again, I'm working about a third of my stitches onto the needle. In this case, I have six decrease lines. So I'm working two of those decrease portions onto my needle. It doesn't have to be exactly a third on each needle, um, but here we go. So I've worked one third of my stitches onto that first needle. I'm now going to grab my second double pointed needle and hold that in my right hand and work another third of my stitches onto that needle or roughly a third. You want about an even number on each. Now here's my third double pointed needle and I'm working the last third of my stitches. As I work all these needles, I'm trying to keep the stitches in the middle of them. So you'll notice I slid those stitches to the center of the double point. So here I have my hat separated onto the three needles and I'm back at the beginning marker. I'm going to work the needle that is to the left of the working yarn with a new needle in my right hand. So I have my fourth double point in my right hand and I'm knitting the stitches off of the first needle. I now have an empty needle in my left hand. I just finished knitting it. So I put it into my right hand and I move along over to the next double pointed needle and I work those stitches onto the newly emptied needle that was in previously in my left hand, now it's in my right. So you're going to keep doing that. Every time you empty off a needle, which I'm about to do, you're going to move it to your right hand and work the next needle in the row all the way around. Happy knitting.